Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, I'm Jennifer Gianni, and today I'm offering um, some more advice on how to get your clients to be more present in their body, to really enjoy their bodies, to feel easier, to get out of their headspace and just more into their heart. Um, so this is an, another offering, acupressure on the face to help them to just dive in a little bit deeper. Um, in the previous videos, we did the acupressure for the ear and we also did the colored glasses. So this is just another offering. So again, just like before, you could add this into any kind of beginning, middle, end sequence in um, your routine in the Pilates studio, especially adding it in with breath cues is a wonderful, wonderful way to um, pair this. So the first one, we're gonna go right to the third eye and you can use the knuckle. So I'm gonna kind of turn here. So you're gonna place the knuckle at your third eye and you can use your other hand to press in. So you just get a little bit more relaxed in your arm and your shoulder. Now at this area, we're starting to message our pituitary gland, which is bringing a little bit more um, balance to the production um, of the hormones. And this is also said to really help relieve anxiety. The second point that I'm gonna offer you is above the eyebrows. And you want the finger placement to be in line with your pupils. So if you go kind of one finger above your eyebrows and you press in and up, this really helps to relieve eye tension and it also helps to calm and or try to get rid of of worry. Our next point is going to be the jaw. So right at the hinge of the jaw. And so many of us have, um, I mean, it's just epidemic in our culture, the um, tension here. So you can use your fingers or you can use your knuckles again. Make sure that the lips and the teeth are parted as you kind of press in and up. You can hold each of these points for about 20 to 30 seconds. Now, at this point, this is of course gonna relieve um, jaw and throat tension. And it also helps to soften resentment and self-abuse. Really, really great point. I can't do this one enough. Next one, the cheekbones. Now, a lot of you will um, really enjoy using this one because this one is great for clearing sinuses. So you go to the bottom of your cheekbone and right at the, that apex point, you take your knuckles and you go in and up. You wanna release your jaw, maybe close your eyes, and again, hold this for 20 or 30 seconds. So this is a really great one to help to relieve sinuses and just to help the whole head space open up. Now these last two I use all the time and I, and I use this a lot during footwork in the beginning maybe of the reformer class to help people again to start to focus in on their breath and just to get rid of the tension in their head. So the first one is at the upper lip, above the upper lip. Um, knuckle kind of butting up right in the center of the the nose there so you want to press in and up it's almost like you're massaging your top gums again you hold that for 20 or 30 seconds and this is one that helps to relieve nose tension and also helps with depression now just below it, under the bottom lip, this is also a great one, and it's like you're massaging your bottom gums. And um, this one also helps with anxiety. It helps to relieve tightness in the head, the jaw, and the whole body. And it also helps 
with emotional numbness. So if you're feeling or you get the sense that your client um, is very resistant towards a lot of things, this might be a really good point for them to hold. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.